Hey everyone, welcome back to the next edition of Cook With Me Thursday. This recipe is for the pasta a fajol soup. It's made in a four quart slow cooker and it will serve six to eight people. These are the ingredients that you're going to need. You'll need one can of great northern beans and one can of light red kidney beans drained and rinsed. One quart of beef stock. The recipe actually calls for um, celery stalks, which I do not have, um, <clears throat> but it also calls for onion. So I use a pack of the seasoning blend by Pick Sweet Farms. Um, and you find this in your freezer section. It has um, peppers and celery and onions in it, and it's really, really good. Um, <clears throat> use one pound of lean ground beef. This is some of my Zacon beef that I pre-cooked um, out of my freezer. A 28 ounce can of crushed tomatoes. Two carrots diced, and I dice mine very small. Um, because I have some family that really doesn't care for carrots, so making them small, they cook and tend to hide in the dish instead of being, <clears throat> excuse me, instead of being seen. One cup of ditalini pasta. You need a teaspoon of oregano, a teaspoon of basil, a half teaspoon of thyme, a teaspoon of salt, a quarter teaspoon of pepper, and two bay leaves. And the salt and the pepper can be um, adjusted to your taste. Okay, if you have it already, you're going to brown your ground beef and then you're going to add it to your slow cooker. Mine is still just a little frozen right in the very middle. So, break that up. You're going to add your beans, your carrots. Your seasoning blend. Your crushed tomatoes. All your seasonings. And your beef stock. Give it a quick stir. Do not add your pasta yet. Put the lid on. Turn it on high for three to four hours or on low for six to eight hours. I'm sorry, seven to eight hours. About 20 to 30 minutes before you're ready to serve it, add your pasta. Brown added hours about 10 minutes ago for me. Um, I'm late getting home. Um, so that's what it looks like shortly after it's been added anyway but there you have it pasta a fajol soup in the crock pot okay I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you will enjoy the recipe give it a thumbs up if you like it and let me know um, in the comments down below if you do make it and what you think I will link the original recipe down below so that you all can find it. You can see what it looks like compared to how I do it for my family. Anyway, y'all have a great day, and I will see you next week for another Cook With Me Thursday video. Bye.